40. Today is Friday, September 23rd, 2022. I'm New Blanchard. Welcome to this Well, he's got whacked pretty hard yesterday. Down a little bit more three quarters of a percent. As you can see, super duper oversold in here. But they're going to become even more oversold on the open. Futures are getting whacked. As I often say, it's always darkest right before it gets more dark. That's why you want to be careful trying to catch that falling knife. Other than maybe on an intraday bounce. Take a look at NASDAQ. As you can see, pretty serious. Short to be term downtrend intact there. Very important for these indices to hold their recent lows in here. It looks like they were trying to make a bit of a head and shoulders bottom, but if they keep sliding, then all bets are off on that. Also, a bottoming process is a process, I should say. Sometimes it takes a long, long time. If we take out the old lows, then ugh, I hate to see that. Let's not worry about that until unless we get there. Take a look at the rusty as you can see down 2% and change. Most areas, as you would expect, getting whacked pretty hard in here. Some areas, a bit of a bummer like non durables, you would think. We'll be bouncing a little bit with a bit of flight to safety, but that's not happening. Gold, neither. So what do we do? Well, you might just want to sit there in your hands and let it all shake out. And of course, wait for entries should you decide to get long anything. We might short, obviously, on the next bounce. Any questions, as usual, Dave, Dave, I'm Dave Landry. You start a market.